Hey fab girls, do you have a closet full of clothing but you still feel like you have nothing to wear? I hear you. So in this video, I'm going to tell you my secret tips on how to have less but always have something to wear. to my channel or you're coming back again welcome it's so wonderful to have you here for those of you who don't know me I'm Tracy Gold I'm a personal stylist YouTube fashion influencer and designer and let me tell you ladies it is my absolute passion to share with you fashion tips that will make you look and feel fabulous no matter your age because I believe everybody deserves to look and feel fabulous so ladies, let's talk about a versatile wardrobe. Now my top two tips when it comes to a versatile wardrobe is number one, get your basics right. Number two, wear clothes or choose to buy clothes that are going to work for you interseasonally. So ones that you can layer or take off layers and that way you're going to have a lot more to wear. Since moving to New York, I had to downsize dramatically. And let me tell you, New York is pretty extreme when it comes to weather, but there's also all these in-betweens. And most of my closet ladies, I have to tell you, most of my closet is interseasonal. Some things for summer, some things for winter, but generally interseasonal. So in this series, I'm going to be showing you how you can get maximum wear out of just a few pieces. And in this video, which is part one, I'm going to start off by talking about the basics. Now when I say basics, everybody goes, oh, how boring. Basics are so boring. You know, your little black dress, your white shirt. You know what, ladies? I don't own a white shirt in my closet at all. And my little black dress is leather. I know, not exactly just your basic little black dress. So I think my philosophy is that your basics will depend on your personal style, your body shape, your lifestyle, and just what you love to wear. So just bear in mind that the basics you're gonna to see today are my good basics, but it doesn't necessarily mean they're going to be your perfect basics. And I don't think it's the same for every woman. Okay, so let's get tucked in. So I have chosen just a few items that are really the core of my wardrobe. And then I'm going to be doing individual videos to show you how you can dress up and dress down and mix and layer these pieces. So that's going to continue through the weeks. So first up, one of my absolute favorites is a good pair of jeans. And I am a huge fan of finding that perfect pair of jeans because it makes your closet so versatile. You can dress things up, you can dress them down. And if you need some more information or some more tips on how to find your perfect pair of jeans for your body shape, and let me just tell you, I'd also talk about these jeans that tuck in the tummy, then you're gonna wanna check out that video. I'll put up a card no, I think it's gonna be on this side. So what I'm gonna talk about now is just really how you can get your versatility from these pieces. So number one is a good pair of jeans. You have to find the ones that best suit your body shape because that's what's going to make them a good basic. Second up is a brilliant or beautiful jacket. There's nothing like a good jacket. It's personally one of my favorite pieces. And for me, I know, real surprise to those ladies who follow me, who have been following me for a while. My perfect basic jacket is a red leather biker jacket. I've had it for a number of years. I bought it in Milan several years ago and I wear it plenty. In fact, if I had to choose one jacket, that would probably be it. But I have a lot of red in my wardrobe, so it's a good basic for me. For you, maybe a neutral color is going to be better, maybe a classic blaze is going to be better. Whatever that basic jacket is, it's an essential. And I'll tell you why because this allows you to take a summer outfit into something that's going into fall, into possibly even winter. You can even sometimes wear a jacket as a top. I do. Next up is a good 
dress. Now it doesn't have to be black, it doesn't have to be basic. In fact, my basic dress is a printed dress. Why? Because print disguises a multitude of things and makes it really, really easy to wear. Again, it's a very easy piece to dress up and dress down. Plus, let me tell you, one of my favorite things about dresses like these is when it comes to traveling, it comes to packing, it comes to anything like that, watch this. Super easy just to do like that. I mean, this could even go into my handbag. And when I used to travel a lot for business, a lot, then I used to just, this is how I used to pack things and then wash and wash it in the sink, hang it up in the shower, and the next day it's dry. Really easy. So ladies, you have to find your perfect dress that's going to suit your body shape. And if you want some more tips on that, then once again, I'll put a card up here. You can check out my video on how to find the perfect dress and that will give you some tips. Next up is a top that you can easily dress up and dress down. Can you wear it with jeans? Can you wear it with a skirt? Can you possibly put it with a pair of basic trousers? All of these things are possible for you if you have the right tops. Okay, so I'm going to be dealing with this one that I'm wearing now is a really, really basic top for me. And ladies, let me just say to you also is that when you have less and you're going to wear more, then you want to invest in good quality pieces. This top I've had, it is actually from my collection. It was from my collection a good couple of years ago. I'm still wearing it. So good quality pieces are really worth the spend if you're going to have less and wear more. So ladies, if you would like to see how these pieces can be worn in different ways and three different ways per item, then stay tuned because each week I'm going to be uploading a new video on this topic. And ladies, also, if you haven't already got your free download on how to dress taller for all those short ladies out there like me, then you want to just click on that little um, link in the first few lines of the description and that will take you to a page where you can just sign up and get your download free. Free tips are always good. So let me know ladies in the comments what your questions are because I am very open to answering all of your questions. I look forward to seeing you next time. Till next week. Bye.